This video will show you how to create a right angle head tool from a 3D model in NC Simul. To begin, create a new tool library or enter into an existing one as shown. Navigate to the Create a New 3D Tool button. Set the tool number and station to load the tool into. In the first tab, under 3D Objects, begin to create layers for each section of the tool by clicking the gray square icon. Then, navigate in Windows Explorer to the location of your 3D models. Once imported, choose the CAD unit and solid layers and then hit Apply. Repeat this process for the inserts, choosing all six layers, and also for the link between the head and the holder. Once complete, continue on to the Position tab. This tells NC Simmel where the attachment point to the spindle should be. It looks to be well positioned already. Next up is the frames, which defines the center of rotation for the tool. Since this is a right angle head, we will want to move the coordinate system out onto the center of the Z axis in the rotational section. Moving on to the association, declare what type of feature each layer is so that NC Simul knows what to use as a collision object and what to use to remove material. Set this for the holder, accessory, and cutting portions. Under parameters, you can define the tool number again if you haven't already done so, as well as the reference names, machining type, cut color, and any other tool limits as desired. Second to last is tuning, where you will set the tool radius compensation and direction based on the model. You can also offset the XYZ gauge length here. And finally, the compensations tab, which based on our original parameters has already been set up to read the compensation equals tool radius. Select Save and OK to exit the library and hit Update Full Tool to refresh everything. Find where the tool is called in the program, click on that line of code, and view the newly created right angle head in the spindle. From here, simply begin a simulation to verify your code and feel confident sending it out to run first time with a tool that can be tricky to catch all possible collisions otherwise.